Hi, I'm Jack Buffington for RobotBrigade.com. This is a, another video in my series of videos about digital logic. And in this one, I'm going to talk about the basic logic gates and their truth tables. Let's uh, take a look at a truth table here. Uh, this is a two input truth table, one output. And the inputs are 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0. 1, 1. Now for any digital logic gate that could take two inputs, uh, if these are the inputs, this would determine what the output would be. Uh, I'm just going to fill in this one really quickly. All right, let's take a look at one of the basic logic gates. And that is a AND gate. An AND gate has, the basic AND gate has two inputs and one output. Uh, an AND can be many inputs, but it always has one output. We're just going to look at the basic case where it only has two inputs. And an AND says if A and B are high, then make the output high. Otherwise, make it low. So that makes this the truth table for an AND gate. Now let's look at another basic one. This is the OR gate. And the, or, the basic OR gate has two inputs as well. But if you were to have many inputs, you might draw it like this. Oops. An important difference between AND and OR is AND is flat back, round front. The OR has a curved back and uh, kind of a football shaped front. Again, I'm only going to show the two input version of it, but pretty much uh, I'll, I'll describe in a second how to uh, go from a two input to something more. So the OR gate says if A or B is high, then make the output high. So here neither A nor B are high, so the output is low. B is high here, so we make the output high. A is high here, so I'm making the output high. And A and B are high, so I'm making the output high. So pretty much, if you want to have a you know, five input AND gate, then all five inputs have to be a one to get a one on the output. And with uh, OR gate, all, let's say it was five input again, all five would have to be low in order to get an output of a low. Oops. All right, we're going to look at one other here. This is the another basic gate. This is a NOT gate or an inverter gate, depending on who you're talking to. And it has one input and one output. And uh, this right here is called an inversion bubble. So the inversion bubble says take the opposite of what would normally come out of here or go into here uh, if you had put an inversion bubble here. This is your basic symbol for an amplifier, the triangle here. So um, you kind of think of it like that. This would be sort of like an inverting amplifier. Uh, anyway, uh, let's just look at B as the uh, input. So if B is 0, the output is 1. And if B is 1, the output is 0. And just ignore this whole A part over here.
Now let's take a look at exclusive OR. Exclusive OR looks similar to an OR gate, except for the fact that it has this second curved line back here. But otherwise, the shape is the same. And the exclusive OR says, if A or B, but only one of them, then make the output high. So the truth table looks like this. All right, so if neither A nor B, so it's the output here, and both A and B are high, and that's not exclusive, so it makes it a low. I'm going to wrap up with two gates that are sort of special in, in uh, logic, and that is NAND. And NAND is drawn like this. It's an AND with an inversion bubble on the end of it. And NOR, NOR looks like an OR gate with an inversion bubble on the end of it. And pretty much it's what you would expect. So A and B, but not the not of that or the inverse of that. So if, um, if AND looks like this, NAND looks like this. All right, it's just the, the inverse of an AND. And for an OR, it's, it's a truth table looks like this. nor looks like this. Now the reason that I say that these are special gates is because from groupings of NAND, of just NAND, and groupings of just nor, you can create any of the other logic gates from that. Uh, whereas uh, it would take an AND, an OR, and a an nor gate uh, otherwise to build any logic function. But I will show that in a, a later video after I have shown a few other things. So uh, if you like this video, check out my YouTube channel or robotbrigade.com. I'm Jack Buffington.